Hello, this is Dr. Liu at Li Tai. In today's video, I will explain how to do a glycerin extractor herb and what are the correct ways to use a glycerin and how to choose the safe glycerin. FDA said there is a one plant material that can make a glycerin contain toxic compounds, which is not to be used in cosmetics products. And I also will use the Centella Asiatica as a herb example to show you step by step how to do the glycerin extract. Glycerin is a trihydric alcohol. It is widely used in food, medicine, skincare, and hair care products. It is used 300 million pounds in US every year. Glycerin is a humectant, that means it can absorb water. That makes it a good moisturizer for skin and keep the skin hydrated. And based on the cosmetic ingredient review panel, they conclude that glycerin is safe to be used as cosmetic product. So in order to find the good glycerin products, there are, firstly, we need to make a clear three terms. The first one is a glycerin. The second one is the glycerol, and the last one is the glyco. So what are the difference between these three terms? Glycerin is actually a name of the product that contains at least 95% of the glycerol. Glycerol is the chemical name. The chemical has a backbone contains three carbon and three hydroxyl or OH groups. That is uh, alcohol. So glycerin and glycerol commonly mixed used and in US glycerin is more popular and in Europe glycerol is more popular. But when you go to the market, remember check the glycerol percentage. For the good product, they will label what is the percentage of the glycerol. Normally it's over 99%. But what about the glyco? The name of the glyco looks similar with the glycerol, but it's quite different. Glyco is toxic. It's an anti-freezing and it's a de-icing agent. It's popularly used in the cooling system, but it's not on the face. So acetylene glyco is one of the major chemical in this group. So don't use it to extract the herb or on the body. Glycerin is a thick liquid, like a gel and a high viscosity. And it's a little bit sweet. And there's two ways to make a glycerin or you can find on the market. One is a little bit cheaper that is normally manufactured from uh, small molecules. And the second one is plant-based glycerin. It is called a vegetable glycerin and the best quality is a food grade. However, be careful, not all the plant-based glycerin is good. From the coconut oil, palm oil, oil, those are the good glycerin you want to buy. As FDA warned, Juchopa, that is a plant that can make glycerin, but it contains toxic chemicals. So stay away from that glycerin. Now I'm going to show you how to do the glycerin extract on the Centella Exotica. Centella Exotica has many benefits on the skin, including the wound healing, reduce the skin units like acne, eczema, and give anti-aging benefits. A research showed the saponin, that's the main functional chemical, and these can be extracted by glycerin. So in today's video, I'm going to use a glycerin and the Centella hydrosol. You can watch my other video to see how to make uh, the hydrosol. And by using the Centella hydrosol to give actual benefits because it contains the essential oil extracted from the Centella. So it will double the effects of the glycerin extract. We're gonna use uh, the dry Centella Azotica leaf. Uh, normally, when you make a glycerin, you wanna use a dry plant material because it contains uh, less water and you can keep uh, your right glycerin concentration. And then, of course, we have a glycerin, the vegetable food grade glycerin, and a, a mixer with a measuring cup. And uh, the other one I want to show you is we're going to use uh, the Centella Azotica Hydrosol um, because we need to dilute the glycerin. The correct 
concentration of glycerin is uh, 65%. As I said, when you buy the glycerin, it's uh, normally 99%. So you want to dilute it. Dilute it has a better extraction efficiency because the water can help wet the material so the glycerin can work. The ratio is a 30 gram this uh, dry Santilla Exotica and uh, this 99% glycerin we need a 100 milliliter and a 50 milliliter hydrosol. Like tincture, glycerin extracted is a slow process. It will take six to eight weeks. So you can put it in, into a closet and every day you shake it because the glycerin is actually heavy. It's heavier than water. So it always like a sit at the bottom. So you shake it to make sure the herb will be fully wetted by the glycerin and then it's good for the extraction. I will leave the recipe in the description part of the video and uh, I hope this is helpful for you to make uh, your glycerin extract. Subscribe to the channel and see you next time.